Joining us today is head men's soccer coach uh, Rob Zalanka. Coach, you guys are have about a week into the preseason now. Um, talk about some of your expectations heading into the 2013 year. I think our expectations are to push forward and keep moving forward off what we did last year. Uh, I think that we're going to be a very solid defensive team. We're bringing in a whole back line of returners. Uh, a, lot, a lot of them have a solid resume, one All-American, a couple All-Region players, uh, and a couple new faces who have been working very hard over the summer to uh, gain playing time and or, and or starting positions. So uh, I think defensively we'll be a tough nut to crack. Our expectation offense is to be very quick, very dynamic. We're bringing back a lot of good players. Um, we are going to be lo we've, we've lost one of our, our top guys from last year, but uh, we're bringing back another All-American goal scorer, and we've been added a couple other really nice players to our mix. So uh, we'll be deep and we'll be quick. Some of the things to build on last year. Let's just run down the accolades: uh, 13 wins. You finished second in the conference. You made it to the NCAA quarterfinals for the first time in school history. How do you how do you take all those things and build off them for this year? Well, I, I think the standard has been set with our guys, and they are holding themselves to that standard. Their goal is to, to attain more as a team and, and individually to to push each other to to meet those goals uh, of last year. I think that our guys are highly motivated individuals and. As much success as possible. How does that? What, what does that mean to you to not only be able to put together a team that scores a lot of goals, but uh, can also break the school record for least goals allowed in a season like you did last year? That's a. That's a. I'm not gonna lie. That's a prideful goal. We. Uh, that's one we want to break again. We've already discussed that. Uh, we felt that we gave away some some goals last year that we shouldn't have. So that is one of our things we want to do. Uh, great teams are great defensive teams, and they don't concede a lot of goals. They allow one goal to stand up and. So uh, that's that's something our teams our, our team prides itself on. So uh, again, I think we'll be a tough team to to, to, to score on. Now the target's already been set, Coach. Uh, you guys are the highest ranked team in the MIAA this season. Going into the season, uh, the coaches, the NSCAA coaches, ranked you guys 14th in the country. So you know, again, what does that mean to you? How, how does that make you feel knowing that the other coaches around the country have, have recognized how, what you guys are doing here? It makes me very proud of my guys uh, that other teams that they've played and, and other coaches saw them and, and recognized the players that were coming back from last year and and rate them so high. I'm very proud of that. That's uh, a distinction that I think uh, is, is, is fantastic. Uh, but it is a mark on our back, like you said. We're targets on our back now for everybody that we play. I think that our guys are willing and ready to step up and, and maintain uh, and show that they are worthy of that honor that, there was, that was given to them. Um, last question, Coach. You guys are going to be battle-tested this year. You have seven games against teams that received preseason national ranks. Uh, three of those are in the first four games of the season all on the road. What do you just talk about the schedule? Well, we want to we want to have the most competitive schedule we can. Uh, we, we want to be competitive nationally feel that the only way to do so is to have a schedule that's really going to test us and, and make us ready for NCAA tournament time should we earn that opportunity. Uh, so it is a really challenging schedule. We're very proud of that. Um, I think our preseason is going to be one of the things that helps us get prepared. Or we're facing two Division One teams as we get ready for that. Uh, a very good Missouri State team and a rebuilding ORU team. Both teams look to be very solid, so we'll we'll be we'll be ready by the time we step onto the pitch for our first official match. All right, coach. Uh, thanks for joining us. Best of luck this year.